Press this, see if it does anything. That doesn't sound like a fart. Oh, there we go. <laughs> Eric. <laughs> That's from Old Navy. What'd you say? What's the inside of that look like? Oh, that's the question. Yeah, is, that's is, is the it spaghetti? question. No, it's not spaghetti. It's scratchy, no. but it's not spaghetti. How much do they want for that? 99 cents. That's not bad. I wonder if there's any more, like, just kind of sitting around. I'm not sure. We'll have to see. What's this here? I think we're Camera back. Here. Yeah. <laughs> so we got the whole store to ourselves. But unfortunately, that means you can hear the um, radio a little bit better. What the heck is this thing? Oh, it's a puzzle. Cyberlism. It's under there. What's that, Eric? Did you find something? Oh, oh Crimberly, my favorite. Oh, we found Trina's mug. That says Trina, right? Gosh, I'm gonna feel so stupid if that's not <laughs> what it actually says. This looks like one of those blenders. This is a cute, this is really cute. This wall print. I'm gonna have this out like displayed a little better because that's really cute and I think someone will buy that. It was just kind of like shoved underneath some stuff. Oh here we got some st stitchery kits. Cozy sewing room. And that's still sealed so we'll look that up. As well as this one for little cafe. They got $2.99 a piece on those. That small one that says, <laughs> welcome to our reading room. That's cute, it's a bathroom. So we'll take a look at those. And actually there's some over here too. Not sure if that's sealed in there. I'll have to take a closer look at that. All right, I decided I am gonna get these two. They are still sealed. Um, or, well, this one's from 1991 and this one's 2001. I'd say maybe 20, possibly a little more than that. What cross stitch? Yeah. Oh, yeah. I right that. here. Those other ones? Um, I did look those up. I couldn't tell if that one was sealed. It's kind of in a bag. Wait, you want these two? Yeah, I want the two that are definitely sealed. I did look those. Here's another Tupperware piece for 99 cents. I think the stuff with the pattern is better. Yeah, um, I do too. If I can find more of them, like if I could make like a set. I had to run all over to check my sneakers before Oh, okay. <laughs> Last time I, was, I waited. Oh, before. this mouse pad is really pretty. This owl. I love that. You need it to That's what I was thinking. I do have one down there, but it's just like real generic -y. I think I'm gonna get it for down there. Yeah. Hey, here's another one down here, Eric. Nine cents. Well, that was opened. Yeah, it's so it's hard to say, but that's a really, that's a really nice print on that. Yeah, it looks like someone kind of um, put all the different colors in their own little bags. There books over here. What the dog saw. What did the dog see? <laughs> Some shoe chaps. Those are from Kohl's. Those look like photo albums. Yeah. yeah. Chimsy ones. And then this is a. At home now. That's home. good for like homeschooling. Just bolt this. <laughs> now I'm finding it for 99 cents. <laughs> okay, let's take a look down this aisle here. What is this thing? Snowman wooden votive holder. Can't really tell what it looks like. This smug. Oh, I missed it. Did you have it open? You didn't. 
I didn't have it. Oh. You'll still wrap them. What's yeah. chop? I love chop. chop. Danger, world's messiest room. Wallpaper. Scoring tool. What's this clock here? Anything down through here? Sometimes you gotta dig. Like, what are these linens? Completely that? cotton. Twin fitted sheet. Wizardry. <laughs> That's the name of it. That's pretty cool. That might be worth taking a peek at. Yeah. You don't sell old sheets very often, but when you do... Well, you don't even come across them super yeah. duper often. They usually end up... That's What's pretty, down in this bin here? It's a whole bunch of plushies. There's, what was that? Fitted and flat? Oh, it's high. Oh, here's a Garfield. Are we having fun yet? He needs cleaned. I guess they're trying to sell this whole bin together. Yes. I'm not really interested in all of that. I'm not sure. Let's take a look at these sheets though. All right, I took the other ones because there's a fitted and flat sheet. This one is just a fitted sheet, but it is by Liberty of London, which is a good brand. Um, but I'm gonna let that one sit since it doesn't have like a, something that can go with it to kind of make it, you know, a little bit of a lot together. Dr. Seuss trivia game. What is up here? Oh, this is pretty. Um, oh, look at this Elsa. Are you paying attention to the cute. No, I'll get over on there. Oh, here's another one. I wonder if they like went to, like, were attached together or something. Maybe not. Um, no, I wasn't paying attention over here yet. I have to take a look. It has a little flower in it. This looks like, uh, it kind of looks older to me, but maybe not. Oh, here's a Hello Kitty pencil case. That's from 2005. Is this like a bento box? Is that what? A bento box? Is that what you said? Potentially. I'm going to stick it in the cart. And I'll look it up. I'm gonna put my potentials up here so I know I have to like Potential. take a look. I know I have to look them up kind of thing. Gold Coast. Always in style. Oven mitts and a little towel. Yes. Fashion art. They are so happy to learn. Jesse Steele for magenta. Maybe we'll take a look at that too. What's down here? This is just fabric. That's cute though. Oopsie dipsy. I knocked some Easter grass out from over here. Trying to see what was in this. Some wrapping paper that says Deborah on it. I wanted to see what was in this box here. Are these ice skates? Are they? They are. are they good ones? They're by a company called Lange. L-A-N-G-E. But they're what are these? Boxing uh, just, gloves. Yeah. They're no seem, good. I they didn't seem very good. Okay. What else I was looking is in at there? Just a little bit ago. Okay. Oh, is that dish no good? What did you see? It's cracked underneath. It's cracked, okay. What about in this bag? Let's take a look at what's in here. It's in a Nike bag. Some more. Yeah, I didn't look in there. There's more boxing gloves. So you said title's not good for boxing gloves? I didn't look at those. The other ones were like really stained up. Oh. Okay. What's in here? Straight line, chalk line reel. Some like 
And the ice skate is mad. Right here. I did not get to see right in here. It's just an empty jewelry. Jewelry case. Look at this candle. Looks like a baby bottle. That has a little LOL puzzle inside of it. Pictionary man. Okay. What is it? These ice skates? Yeah. Let's <clears throat> see what's on this side here. There's some. Are these golf shoes? Little kids. Little kids golf shoes. Oh, this is a cute little Clinique bag of an apple. Mug. I'll have to see what that says. I can't. This is a Henry Bendel mug. Uh, he makes very expensive stuff. I'm not sure about mugs. I know see, more about purses. I looked at that and I put it back down because it said <laughs> made in China. No, I'm gonna look that up. What's this hallmark down here? A little like wedding album. It looks like is this Lennox? Looks like it'd be. It's only 99 cents. Star candy dish. All right, so Eric looked up the Henry Bendel mug. I'm telling you, like, they're, um, his purses and stuff are very expensive. I wasn't sure about the mugs, but... Right there is the exact one, one that sold about a month ago. 199 That's wild. That is pretty wild. Who's buying, that who's buying $100 that, mug? <laughs> that makes this trip completely worthwhile for sure. Look at this piggy bank. Oh my gosh, it's a sheep. That is so cute. What's that? Yeah. What is down it's there? There's no markings on that. It is. Oh God, it looks... <laughs> what is it? Nice. Oh, you put that in like, well, you put the hose in the tub to make it kind of like uh, a, um, okay. a bubble bath. Look out for more of them mugs, man. <laughs> I need more, I need more than mugs. That says Austria on it. There is a lot of like chippies and stuff. Yeah, I saw a lot of tag peels. This is Crabtree and Evelyn. That's empty. But Crabtree and Evelyn is a nice brand, like for um, Bath and Body type products. And some, some of their stuff is discontinued, which makes it even more desirable. So if you ever come across anything, buy this brand. Definitely. Oh my gosh, are they allowed to sell these? These are like literally cigarettes. What are they? Cigarettes. <laughs> or like flavored cartridges, I guess. I don't know. Whoa, I just didn't think that would be something they could legally sell. Needs no ice. Wait, let's check this out. What's in here? Oh, I thought it was still sealed and it's not. Ooh, that's had it been still sealed. I, well, I was just wondering if maybe you had seen any more of those this guy bugs. Caught my eye at first. Wow, yeah, and it's like mixed in with some other stuff. What's this? This plate's pretty for decorative purpose only. It's from Christmas Tree Hill. If you ever do find these, um, Yankee Candle lampshades. A lot of them sometimes have soot. Soot gets on them, obviously, from the candle being lit, but that does come off. I purchased one before, and it cleaned up really nice, so. Don't let that discourage ya. What's this say? Handmade quality. That's a really pretty light there. Make I'm sure I'm not missing anything. Okay, moving along. Oh my gosh, what's this? Is this a Laurel Birch tea? It is, it is. Oh my gosh, I love it. 
Please don't be chippy. Please don't be chippy. Oh, I absolutely love it. It's two ninety nine. Even if it's not worth much, I want it for myself. So. <laughs> cool. <laughs> Yay! You got very excited there. You can, I mean, if you want to, you can look it off, but I mean. <laughs> if you want it, it doesn't matter. Yeah. I want that. <laughs> Will I keep it? it? I don't know. You'll end up selling it. You know. <laughs> You'll like cherish it for a day or two. Yeah, okay. I just. I like to look at it, like and I'll be happy looking at it. Yeah, I get that way. I do. I feel like I've seen this mug before. Oh, Jesus. Which, which one's that? Gold Mickey. Like. Yeah, I saw that last it's... time I was here, but it wasn't in like the best condition. It had seen better days. Lemony Snicket's Parlor Game. What's this? Little Noah's Ark. House of Hatton. It's interesting. We'll take a look at that. This little Noah's Ark ornament is selling between $8 to $12. They want $2.99. I'm not going to take it, but... It is very cute. I'm kind of curious about this bowl. Er, what did you mean? Well, actually, I'm just going to set this over here for like a minute because I wanted to look at the bottom of this. I want to look at the bottom of this bowl. Looks like someone already did. Swing. Is that what that says? Swing hand painted. That's really pretty. Okay, I got a you got a question. Here, let me put this back though. I'll take your expertise. <laughs> My expertise, yeah, okay. <laughs> Throw it at me. Okay, recipe cards can definitely so we have be good. One through eight, okay. nine through fifteen. And what are you seeing as far as prices? And who are they made by? Great American recipes. Um I've heard good things about these. Obviously, like handwritten recipe cards are great, but even these sets can do really well as well. So what did you say you were seeing? I was looking at possibly maybe 25 each. 25 each? Maybe. How would you ship these in a 13, 13, 9? Large priority box. They wouldn't fit in a medium flat, would they? <sighs> hey, da, 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 da. I think you'd be pushing it with that, but... I'm probably pushing it because of the plastic case. I don't think the plastic case is going to matter so much, though. Yeah. It has it. It's not shattered, but there are some cracks. And they're all there and accounted for? Yeah, I mean, it looks, is... it looks like they would be, but I mean, it's going to be hard to really know that, per se. How much are they? Three bucks each. That one I'm leaving up to you. I'm going to leave it up to you. How, how much are you thinking, that, or how, what do they sell for? It looks like maybe 25 bucks. Consistently? Yeah. We decided to pass on these. Apparently, there's one more set that would go with them. Um, yeah, we're not quite the whole way through the series. Yeah, so nay to those. Heavy. Yes, very heavy. All right, let's go down this aisle, and then we'll go over to the toys. It's a little cat's meow. St. Catherine of Siena Church. I just want to go down here real quick. I never normally find much in like this little silver area here. Here's a CD player. That works. Sony. I don't know. Maybe we'll take a look at that anyway. JVC. Okay, so I was going to look past this just because it's JVC. I always thought that was kind of a lower end brand of yeah, electronics regardless. Really. I mean, it's not the highest. But, end, um, but it's not there's bad. no solds, but man oh man, look at these prices. I mean, these are from the UK, but even still, that's probably like $100. Someone's selling this whole set for $69. I mean, 
heck, this is $2.99. I'll sell it for like $30. <laughs> you know what I mean? Yeah. So, as long as it plays, all right. I mean, it doesn't have headphones, but it doesn't look like these other ones do either. It looks decent, but it does have... The adapter Yeah, thing. that's kind of wild. Yeah, well, we'll get that. We'll definitely get that. Do we, do we have a CD to test it? Oh, of course we do. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> yeah, I do. I have a pair of earbuds that plug in, so. Okay, let's see. Is there any games? Monopoly Junior. Wow. There's a lot of toys in here. Not really seeing anything popping out at me though. There's a Power Rangers puzzle. Is that older or newer? Uh, it's not original. I mean, uh, Wild Force. Who knows? I don't know. <laughs> Yeah, I'm not sure either. Okay. Do I, I have Power Rangers, but I'm not selling them. Do you want to go over to the toys over here? Let's check, check out over here. We'll just make our, make our way around here. I don't really look at the CDs very much. Well, Eric, if you're afraid we don't have a CD, let's just get one. <laughs> Which one would you pick out of what's available here? I'd pick Taylor Swift. <laughs> I don't think we're going to have anything along my taste. We have CDs. We've got Wu-Tang. Well, there you go. That's not really along my taste, but I'll take it. <laughs> oh my gosh, what did I just do? I, I just knocked something down back there. There's no way I'm going to be able to get it. I'm a horrible person. I couldn't find this specific one, but some textbooks, especially for homeschool, can be really good. Um, I didn't see that specific one, and it's written in, and it's not, it's not really newer. It's from 2001, so I'm going to just let it sit. I actually have this book, The Secret Language of Birthdays. It has absolutely every single date. Um, in there of every month and then it tells you all about who you are as a person based off the day that you were born and it's actually really weirdly accurate it's a pretty cool book all right let me just take a look at the VHS tapes just to see oh, check this out. <laughs> Beauty and the Beast that's got Ron Perlman as the Beast. I've never actually seen that one. I'm just seeing if there's anything in here that I'm interested in, but I don't see anything. What about down here? Is there any... What are you looking for? Pretty much anything. Amateur home cooking. The century that made America great. Well, I'm looking for old VHS tapes. Obscure horror movies. Obscure horror movies, which I'm not really seeing anything too interesting, so we'll move along here. You didn't? All right, well, I'll take a quick look and electronic talking clue. That sounds pretty cool. Bratz Mall Crawl. Might take a look at that. Oh, here's Chip. That's Chip. I love Chip. Gas out. Try me. Oh gosh. Press that. Toilet <laughs> go. Press this. See if it does anything. 
That doesn't sound like a fart. Oh, there we go. <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> okay, we're children. Yeah, we are. I realize. It's quite all right. Sometimes. You gotta have fun. What in the heck is this thing? I can't tell if it wants to be menacing or beautiful. <laughs> I feel like I need to like try and figure out what Don't that is. No. Oh. Oh, it flies. It flies. Cool. Whoa. Neat. Okay. I'm using fly pretty loose. <laughs> All right. I had to look up where this came from. It went with Ever After dolls. Um, this one's name is Brayburn. Looks like one sold for ten dollars, which is not much. But if you have the um, the pet and the doll together, um, it looks like it sells for like twenty five ish. So had it had the doll with it, I definitely would have probably picked that up. All right, I'm gonna look through the purses. I think Eric went to the clothes. I'll probably take a quick look through the clothes. E collection. This looks like a long chomp. Oh my gosh. Oh my gosh. Nah. -uh. Nah. -uh. I did not just find a long chomp here. For $4.99, the interior really needs cleaned. I have one of these bags I paid full price for. They're super expensive. Oh, do, 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 do. That's pretty awesome. I don't think this one's authentic though, and I'll tell you why. The stitching on it is not good. Do you see how that stitching right there is completely crooked? Yeah, it's not authentic. That would have been awesome if it was. This is a B. Mikowski. Makes really nice leather bags. Um, it's six dollars and ninety nine cents. Unfortunately, the leather on it is very discolored. Like it's brighter down here, lighter at the top. I just don't really care for the discoloration on that. I just love the bow on this. Magdesian. Take a look at that. This brand, Magnesians, um, prices are all over the place. I'm not gonna get it. Um, it's a cute bag though, but. RSVP, that's what that says. This. Kind of looks like a computer. Laptop. That's by Massimo. <laughs> Trying to see what's down there. Got some Vera Bradley's. That one's cute. It's like a clutch. What's back here? Got a. Is that a skull? I don't know why I saw a skull on that. It's another computer bag. I thought maybe I'd get lucky over in the purses since I saw that what I thought was a long chomp, but unfortunately, it is not. I love these big bags when I go to yard sales. 
Okay, I'm not really seeing anything in the bag section. I do want to go over here and look at the, um, just go over the plushies. Let's just check the hats real quick, too. Um, I look vintage trucker hats, but sometimes sporting stuff is good, too. I don't know what a zephyr is, but I might look that up. Cannon Blast. Just dropping everything over here, aren't I? Um, is that a piece of bacon? Okay. <laughs> I don't know what I'm seeing sometimes. see Pokemon. Heck yeah. It's a Pokemon. Yeah, we'll check, take a look at that too. What's this guy? Batman. That's pretty cool as well. This is totally me. I am the best cat sitter. <laughs> Alright. What is this? Sun, Moon, and Star Bell. Made in India. It's completely sealed. Let me see if I can open it from the bottom. Surprisingly, this is really cute. It makes farm animal coasters with a holder. Oh my god, it listed for like ten dollars. So, I'm not picking it up, but it's cute. Caravan? Gold. This is pretty crazy. What size are they? The gold's coming off of it, though. I could wear them. They're my size. The gold's coming off of it. Nacho. Oh, I'm yawning. I'm yawning I'm really hard. Uh, All okay. right. I think I'm here. <laughs> you always say that. Of course you're here. Oh, you're here. <laughs> <laughs> All right, guys. So we just finished at one Goodwill and we are ready to hit the one down the street. Um, it's always interesting. Like when we go into the thrift store, like you just never know what you're going to find. Sometimes we go into a thrift store and we don't find a no. thing. We come out empty handed. It happens. Yes. Like I get all ready to record it and then. Yes yeah. It happened yesterday. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I think it was the day before yesterday. Was it? Yeah. Okay. Um, but <laughs> anyway, but we actually did find some stuff at this Goodwill, so I'm excited. It snowed, and literally when we got here, we were like the only ones yeah. in here, so that kind of helped, I guess, a little bit. Um, but yeah, we're going to hit um, another one and see if we can find anything there. I probably jinxed myself, and now we won't find anything there. But We still made out <laughs> here, so that's okay. Yeah, we did. So let's get to the next one and see if we can keep finding some good stuff. On this little black leather coach wristlet for $3.99. That's cute. Small, but cute. I like the handle on this mug. That's pretty cool. Baby sleeping. What are these? Wax mops? A lot of jazz swim. Bahama. I think Eric is like way ahead of me now. There's a lot of these things. Cake cutter. That's probably actually very, very useful have. <laughs> What's in here? Temper glass. Oh, those are coasters. Oh, these cups are pretty. I get those a little better, but they're yeah, like really yellow. stuck in there. A pea yellow. Is that how you described it? Well, oh, nice. there we go. Yeah, they're not bad. They oh. look like they have a good like feel to them they like when you're holding them. Rounded edges instead of sharp. But pea yellow, as, yeah, as you said. Yeah, it looks like little pea spots. <laughs> so let's crate and barrel. Set. Wow. What is this? <laughs> cold, <laughs> cold brew, <laughs> empty cold brew bottle. Those are cute. Yeah, we got poo prints, man. This person went with pea glasses, not poo prints. <laughs> poo prints. 
Oh, uh, you are. You'd be cute in a. You are relatable. Oh, of course. <laughs> Look my brain. Here we go. Again. Here we go again. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone wants to do something. <laughs> oh, goodness. Looks like a candle plate. Yep, Yankee candle. Where's the lampshade to it? It's Just beachy. Plate. It is beachy. Here. I throw in a fish. A fish? It's like something in here, but it's pink and I don't know what it is. It's a mystery box. Open it up. I'm not opening it. There or other boxes inside of it. Oh, see? So did you open that one? <laughs> no, because I think it's safe to assume that if they're all boxes and they just get smaller as they progress. Did you have one of these? I did, yeah. I think every refrigerator had one of those Actually, growing up. One of these, but I don't have cans very yeah, often. Yeah, we don't really Ooh. drink from cans often, but I prefer soda in a can.